In this video, I will show you how to set up and use Blender's Quick Favorites feature. So if you press the Q button, that is gonna bring up the Quick Favorites. Now, if you don't have anything in the Quick Favorites, it's just gonna say that there is nothing there. And so how you add something to the Quick Favorites is you first need to find where it is. So for instance, I'm gonna click on Object, and then I'm gonna click on Set Origin, and then I'm gonna go right down here to the Origin to Geometry, because this is something that I use a lot, but it's a little bit hard to get to, and if I add it to the Quick Favorites, then I'll be able to speed up my workflow. So I'm going to right click on this and then I'm going to click on add to quick favorites. So now instead of clicking on object, set origin, and then origin to geometry, I can just press the Q button and that is going to show you all of the quick favorites that you've added and I can just click on origin to geometry. And you can continue to do this and add lots of different things into your quick favorites. And for instance, I could also go over to the modifier properties. I could click on add modifier and I can right click on the decimal modifier add that to quick favorites that's a common one I use and for example one more thing I could add is right here so I could right click on the toggle x-ray and add to quick favorites so now if I press the Q button they're all going to come up now when this feature was first released into blender I was kind of confused because I would add some things to the quick favorites but then I would close blender and open up a new blender file and when I pressed the Q button it wouldn't save the settings and why that was happening is because I didn't save the preferences in blender so after you add anything to the quick favorites, you just need to click right here on edit, and then you need to open up the preferences. And then right here, you just need to click on the save preferences button, and then I can just close the user preferences, and then I'm just gonna close Blender and open up a new Blender file. And here I am in a new Blender file, and if I press the Q button, you can see it saved my quick favorites. And then for some reason, if you wanna remove the quick favorites, you can again just go to the setting. I can right click right up here, I can click on remove from quick favorites, and then again, I just need to open up the preferences just right over here click on the save preferences so blender's quick favorites is a really cool tool to access different options that you use a lot and if you'd like to watch another video that i have on how to speed up your blender workflow then you can check out that video right up there on 10 tips on how to speed up your blender workflow so i hope this video was helpful and thank you for watching